Lea Leofano, short ball to Moen. Nobody in front of him. So it's taken a while. And... Well, some lovely play here. Was a good ball. Moen ran the good angle. Tamua sucked in two, possibly three defenders there. Then as it shifts wide, Farrell flat, picks the right pass, the double pump, Jackson Ray, straight into the action, one line out say, one bust. Vunipola popping up out of the back of the hand as he did last week in Toulon. Farrell lets Hadley Parks jump, throws it out over the top. Anyone, anyone who questions Farrell now as a fly off him who plays football is a buffoon. Caught by Robert Dupria, took a lit. And a, a wonderful get from uh, Lizana here. Yeah, good pace. Cordero to his left. And Cordero will score. Knee not over. And again, Lizana prominent in attack. It's count and punch. Punch and counter punch by the Aguares. And he fed a flying Cordero on the left wing. And he's in for his brace. Guinea. Quick hands. And Scott Sio. Running off a beautiful ball from Kepu, gets his first test try, and it's a little beauty. Oh, Ella, what about the step by the big man? Ella, 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 Toa. I think it's, a, it's been played out. But of here's the feature Ruan Smith, reserve prop to the other reserve prop, Ella, Toa. That left footer there deserves five points immediately. Is Retallick in his normal role, frees it up to White Crocker, oh. and oh, that's brilliant. Becky Tower grabs number two. Is vintage back play from a loose head prop, punches the line, draws the last defender, and puts a back underneath the post. White Crockett, you couldn't do that any better. That is brilliant to watch. Well, they're turning on a bit of an exhibition here now. Bye. Goes to Graham. First man play. Good pass by Graham for Adam Elliott. The Roosters were looking to their left hand side. Elliott poured through a hole. Well, the mistake by Mitchell Pearce is they've paid a heavy price to Roosters. O'Connor with the tackle. Boss. Here comes Fanning. Here's the score. Leak from the left wing there. Monster failure right here, quite right. Keep an eye on the fanning because he was almost invisible. It's popping. And there is still blood popping for the great of Hornby. What a ball from Ben Hornby. Slide of hand. It's gorgeous, look at it. Oh, the decoy did his job. Both Scott, he drew a couple, the gap presented, oh, lovely. And the Dragons, oh, here they come. <laughs> he was about to put the exclamation mark on his superb season. Townsend giving it to Lola here. He's in again. They can't stop him. He's irrepressible. Wigglesworth scrabbling for the ball for Gallo. Jamie George is on the charge, and here he goes through a giant hole. Perfect, and the try will be scored, and what a moment for Wigglesworth. Ten tries in the past eight games against Aussie opposition. So Barnes, flat oh. pass, straight through goes Rob Horn. Welcome back, Rob. The Springbok goal line three times in the match, but still no try scored. 
Barnes again. Yes, here it is. Ashley Cooper. He raises his fist in the air. Into the crowd, the boys. I'll probably go to the video ref on that one as well, will I? Oh, great ball. Jacques Ferry went too wide to Villiers. Adam Ashley Cooper, try time. Well, that's the old the old uh, Stephen Larkin ploy. You guys just run outside me and I'll pick the man who's in the motion. That's what Jacques Ferry and de Villiers, they didn't know what was coming. And look at the runners in motion. Beric Barnes, first receiver. But you have a look there, Tim. What happened was they started on the angle and then in unison, the players straightened back up. Which very, then... very similar plays that the Springboks use that as well. The Mac involves Simpson again. Penalty coming. Here goes Goppin. Oh, launch free. Can see it. Joe Simpson's come on, added a little bit of pace. That's a super pass from Gopeth, but Connor had just stretched too wide, and Launchbury lumbers through it. One of the more prominent ball carriers, Sexton for Carberry, goes wide. That's a fabulous pass, and it's a brilliant try for the forward. And this is the killer pass. Joey Carberry, we know he's got so much ability. Brian, but the vision, the vision to see his man out there and fire it on the spot. Absolutely brilliant. Out there, Gale, Gale with the pass to Webster! Webster's the hero! Webster gets his second try! Side. Similar sort of like for like. Oh, Hodgson. Hodgson. What an eye! What a pass! What a try! The Ford who could perhaps do this, like Charlie Hodgson. Delightful pass, superb decoys. But Jamie George, I don't know if Alex Good is still with Simo down on the touchline, but I don't know if the Saracens fullback could have picked that line. That is brilliant. continue to hold out, they go to Barrett, pops it up, and Woodward is through! Foden Barrett gets this, watch this nice little soft hands here, straight through the hole, great line, Woodward. Yes, I may well have done him a disservice before the game, questioning his ability at centre, he certainly in the last two times looked to hit into that gap. It's a great skill for a centre to have, rather than just run his pre-planned line. As no doubt, as Kerbalo has a little dab, short pass, It's not a lot doing here. The ball isn't lightning quick. Watch Kerbalo. He goes, he goes, he's lasered off. It holds Ellis. Retallick, the big man, too strong, but Kerbalo, very well done. Lucky it was Retallick. You wouldn't want one of the backs because he just had enough reach. The big man, and you're right, Marshy. Umbra four helps to clear. Paul Marshall. Diak, the captain. He's got the third try. Control at the back from Wilson. Marshall then moves it to Luke Marshall again, hitting the hitting the game line so flatly. Quick ball, but a beautiful pass by Marshall. Just draws the man in, creates half a yard. And Robbie Diak coming round the corner, straightening. Just enough carry to get over. Denny it. Looks for some more! <laughs> didn't want that, and Tamua who's had a very decent start to the game, is strong, and 12 trees is not going to enjoy that. Anything but. Bang. A moment or so ago. And oh, true goes Kurandrani. We see here, White throws the ball into space. So you see there, Corey Jane, he's watching the ball. Kurandrani's watching the space to run into. Classic Brumbies play, spins through the hole, try. Yeah, got it. So and they have momentum, he always gets the momentum. And a hole for Ficky Toy to slice through. Taken just five metres out from the line. And Vince Asawa are going to have a busy night if they can't control Ficky Toa. Absolutely, and that there, that replay there, Smithy, just highlighted also not only Ficky Toa's running line, the beautiful pass of Aaron Smith right out in front, and he was able to punch on it. If we pause it here as Aaron Smith gets the ball, at this pass out in front, what we're trying to talk about, you see the line of Fikitoa. Now, without the pass, as we roll it on, out in front, he doesn't make the hole, but it's beautiful. Aaron Smith's greatest asset, without doubt. What a magnificent pass. They have a couple hey, of goes at it. He sets it on the 10. Emery, oh, a beautiful drip from Emery. Got on the outside.
outside the defence, and now inside the 22 he goes. But this is the pass again, beautiful pass from Aaron Smith, just gets between two players, Emery's line is outstanding. Yep. Highlanders go looking for their second. Franklin waiting for it, they go past him to Osborne, brilliant pass. Fighting his way to the five. Now here's Ficky Tor trying to smash his way over. That's the